What is the difference between a labyrinth and a maze? Now, I was amazed to really discover the difference. And mechanically, it's quite simple. A labyrinth essentially has one way in, one way out, along the way is like a serpentine path, whereas a maze is sometimes more circular and they're full of forks and blind roads and dead ends and, uh, and things like that. So the whole intention of a labyrinth, if you go back in history, uh, many traditions, particularly the Judoi Christian tradition, they use these labyrinths as a form of prayer and meditation. So they would enter the labyrinth with a straight spine and the palms either in front or interlocked behind the back and they would mindfully walk step by step, step by step in this labyrinth and quite often repeating an incantation. And sometimes it was like a substitute for going on a pilgrimage. So it was a deeply mindful and present practice. A maze, however, is designed to be challenging. It's designed to wrong put you, send the wrong direction, to put you into these dead ends and, and go all over the place for, for no real purpose. So knowing this, I've asked myself the question, how am I living my life? Am I living my life like a labyrinth or a maze? Now all the mystics, ancient, modern, eastern, western, seem to live their lives like it's a labyrinth in that they're always in the right place at the right time on the right path because there only is one path and of course the path bends and turns there's always adventures around the corner they stop now and again if they hear a bird chirping or some leaves rustling and they keep on walking mindfully enjoying the journey knowing that they're always on the right path these are the mystics and then you have the rest of us, the mistakes, if you will, who, uh, who basically run in this maze trying to win the challenge and it's causing frustration, anxiety, stress. There's sometimes there is a, there's jealousy or oh, this person is so much further ahead in this maze or sometimes there's arrogance. Look, this person is lost in a blind alleyway, what a fool. And then somehow some people are depressed, frustrated, I can't figure out this maze. And eventually some of us get to the center of the maze and uh, that's the definition of success. We have successfully conquered the maze. And what are some of society's barometers of success? The, the big house, the big car, the lovely job, the health, the friend and family and things like this. And very often we solve this maze, we, have, we pick up all the flags along the way, we've got all the benchmarks of success and yet there's a hollowness and emptiness inside. Why am I not happy? Because you realize you're stuck in the middle and you've got to get your way out again. Whereas if you live as if life is a labyrinth, there's always just a process. A labyrinth is a process-oriented way of living, whereas a, a maze is more like a goal-oriented way of living. So uh, I hope this video encourages you to enjoy this most precious of gifts, this labyrinth of life that we find ourselves in. So enjoy the steps. And I'll see you in the library. Much love.